everybody, this is V, and welcome to Designers by V. How are you, have you guys been? Well, hope everything is all right with everyone, and the summer is coming along fabulously. Now, today, just want to do like a little chit chat with you because I'm going to bring you a haul sometime tomorrow. Plus, I plan. Listen, I haven't been getting anything done in this house. Between the travels, getting the boys ready to leave, um, having to run outside, pick up this, go here, go there, like it's becoming a little bit too, too much. So... Now today, it was another graduation, right? I'm, I'm just like graduation out. I am so happy of my children's success and the things that they are, you know, individual and the things that they are um, doing. And I'm so glad that it happened and I'm so glad that it's over. And now I can get back to like a kind of regular scheduling. Um, I'm just getting back, maybe about, whew, her graduation was a little bit earlier. Then while I was out, I thought to go to Home Depot, oh, let me run here, let me run there, because I'm out. Once I'm out, I could think about a million things to do, because I'm like, I love to travel, but I am really a homebody. So once I'm in the house, it's really hard to get me out. But once I'm out, nighttime, get me back in this house. So that's why I have, uh, I need to do stuff like the dishwasher need to be offload. Um, um, the microwave to stand to get a wipe down. There's a few things. It's like a um, cup and whatever, two glasses and a cup in the sink. Um, my niece just used that. So... I am going to get back to giving y'all regular videos. I thought I would have done something this week. Then I started to do it. And um, then I'm like, oh, I should get another carpet for the dining room. Even though I did do a video showing you me putting the dining room together. I'm like, this is too small. Let me get out there and get, them, get a different carpet to... A different rug to put on the floor so that is coming up soon because I think I located one but you know like you see something and you're saying to yourself you know what if I go somewhere else I could find something better but it never happens so I am um, going to go back to that store that I seen the um, piece at and the rug the area rug at and I'm going to get it and it's going to work perfectly um, going forward like um, I think tomorrow when I set up the diamond because I'm going to do the curi my um, china cabinet tomorrow and that's a china cabinet that I have in my breakfast slash eat in everyday area and um I'm going to set it up tomorrow and put away some of the dishes. The only dishes that I put away is like the everyday dishes that we use. But my platters and um, um, other type dishes, like the dishes that just in the kitchen that we use on an everyday is all white or marble or white with marble. And then the others that I use for, um, you know, the color the color pieces, I have them um, in my china cabinet and some for downstairs because I have dishes for up here and dishes for downstairs because there's two kitchens in, in this home. So what I want to, um, I have a haul on the ground here for you also, but I'm not going to do it tonight. Um, what I want to show you a bit off is oh you like my outfit girl <laughs> you like my outfit I heard you girl you like what she wait what, 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 
V. What you wearing, girl? What you, girl, 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 girl. God, I don't even know what I'm doing. Um, this is a outfit. I'm trying to think about where I purchased this. I might have purchased this in Paris. I. It's uh, like an Indian outfit, but I think I purchased this in France. Um, that and another yellow one that I have. Uh, I'm not too sure. But it's this thing here, and like I tell you, I like like loud clothes. Like this is like bright orange. And what I'm wearing with it is. Can I put out this thing a little bit more? Okay. I'm wearing some. Yes, girl. You just seen me in an orange dress and I have on yellow pants. Yes, I love loud toes. And you see this? Look at all of this. And this is designed by the, the pants is, but the, um, the dress is not. So... And this is how it is. It has like a little shorts under it. It has a little shorts under it. And yeah, I'm wearing a yellow bra too. <laughs> Some type of fashion shirt. Yeah, and I'm, um, I, I like, like I told you, I like free, like, I could wear, I could wear tight stuff. But the best clothes that I like to wear is loose clothes. And as you see, I don't have like much of like, I gain weight, but I don't have a lot of weight on me. But I like wearing loose clothes. You could always find me in something that is free <laughs> and should I say flamboyant? Like, out there like this and out there like that. I know people look at me like, where's she going? And you know what? I don't have to be going anyway to put this on. My husband is like, oh, let's go to dinner. And I'll just go put on, like, you know, go in my closet, pull up something, put it on. He'll be fine with it because he likes to dress too and he loves to see me dress up. And my kids, they, you know, I've always dressed, but they'll look at me like, Oh, I have a story. One day, right? I'm going to show you what I'm going to show you in a second. I just have to tell you. One day, when we just moved to Tennessee, I went to go pick up my son at a friend's house. My husband and I, I think we had gone to Atlanta for like the first time. Somewhere we went. We went away for the weekend. But then we came back in and I went to go pick him up at his friend's house. So, when I came out, I, did, I just didn't want to just, you know, just drive by, have him jump in the car. My husband was driving, as usual. Have him jump in the car and then um, and um, say bye to the people. So, it's a new neighborhood we moved into. So, I was like, you know what, let me just get out and say hello. So, I got out, rang the bell because he was expecting us because I called him. And then he came, my son came to the door and he was like, Ma, really? Really? Did you just put this on to come pick me up? And I was like, what you talking about? I was like, you know I left since this morning. He was like, y yes. He was like, oh, you know why? Oh, that's okay, Ma. That's okay. So then I was like, kind of taken back by it because he know his, mo he know his mama. So then he came and he told me later on, he apologized. That's my baby, Edgar. He came and he apologized and he said, you know what, mommy? Be yourself. He said, um, he doesn't see like any of his kids, parents, like anybody else dressed like me. You know, a lot of the moms that he know, like, you know, with his sports team and all of that. Well, you know what they wear. And yes, I would show up to a game looking like this. Be the best cheerleader. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just love to dress. 
and my clothes is not for an occasion. Like, I have clothes that's for different occasions. But, you know, different things like this. is a You know, the truth is, is according to how I feel. Because if I get up on, I don't like kind of save my clothes like. Like if I get up and I have to go to church. And I feel like wearing a gown to go to church. That's what I'll do on that day. Life is too short for, for me to be thinking, oh, what this person is going to think. I spend my whole life being shy or, you know, or thinking what this person is going to think or what they're going to say. And believe me, as long as it's not a, the judge is not putting a gavel down and giving you a life sentence, listen, I won't be able to deal with jail. You know why? There's no thrift in there. There's no shopping in there. So I wouldn't do Lord, I shouldn't say that, right? I should say, oh, my kids are not going to be there. And, you know, I'm going to miss them. They come see me. No, no, no. I'm not going to jail. <laughs> There's no thrift in there. So, um, enough of me and my... Hey, listen. I have a, another one like this. I think a white one. One day I'll wear it and I have like a whole head, you know, the whole headrest in the um, crystal that droops in your face and a oh, curl. You don't want nothing to do with me. And look at these earrings. See these earrings? And they are blingy also. My hair get caught in this one. They are blingy also. And look at all of that. And I, you know, people buy bling and they like putting it in their home. I wear bling. See all of this? All of this glitterization? These are stones. You see like the same stones and the stuff you will buy in home goods that shimmers and glitters? It's on me. And it goes all the way down. And then look at these. Yes. At one point... I did cut this off and then I reattached it so that's what you are that's what you are seeing here right now and it's um, in the back is one way and then did I say in the back is one way in the front is like this and it has this collar on it and then in the back it's like this here with this right here and then it's um you can see my bra and my pants through it because I just love that when the summer come in the winter I'm all bundled up because I hate to be cold so in the summer I wear really next to nothing but a whole bunch of fabric just draping my body that's how I do it so let me show you girl I know you say she could talk. Oh my gosh, she could win a competition. Yep, 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 away. <laughs> so, as you see, this is what I've done with the place so far. Not much. Um, that's my, um, I forget, this is a Dutch oven. This is a cute pot. Let me show it to you. It's cute, it's cute and it's heavy, like all oh, get out. It's a cast iron pot. Um, I'm going to take you in, I'm not really doing like a kitchen tour, so I'm going to take you in maybe after and show you, not today, but another time when I do a tour. But what I really wanted to show you, and my mouth all yapping and yapping away, I think I'm going to turn this around. How can I turn this around? I don't think I could. Let me just turn it this way. Okay. So this is the sink area and it's at night. So, I have these two here. One I purchased when we moved here. And the other one I already had from the last place. But this is not what I come to show you. I come to show you tomorrow. This is one of the projects that we are going to take on. I have these. See where the soap dispenser is? There's two right here. As you see this little bottle I have right here. I I don't know how to call it, but 
I've been told that I should not do this, but I've been doing it for so long. At this point, I really can't stop. It's just, I really can't stop. This is bleach and water in this bottle, like this much bleach. And I usually put like this much water in here, like this much bleach, this much water. I must and have to wash my dishes with bleach. I'm not, you know, I'm not telling anyone to do it, but this is what I like to do. So I am going to put, I'm going to take this piece here out. Let me see if I could take you in. Can you see it? It's right here. It's a silver piece. Yeah, right here. I'm going to take this out. And the other one for the soap dispenser is here. Oh, let me make sure this is off. Oh, because this is like a touch kind of situation. Yeah, this is, you touch it and it comes right on. So, I am going to put... I think the bleach in this one and this one here I just bought a new one I bought one today at um, Lowe's and I am going to put my bleach in this one soap in this one that I don't have to leave this out or somebody knocking it over which they may not but hmm. and then Right here over the sink. Right here over the sink. Oh, I have my vitamin drops here. Um, I have this here. I have it many moons ago. As you see, it's like really old and it has the um blue and white on blue and white on it. See? Cute. I love, love, love copper. And then I have this piece here that I am it's a spoon rest, but what you see here is the um pepper seeds and I'm going to plant them to I'm going to plant them in the backyard so I just have this sitting here on top of this ledge I am going to put some um, marble on here too because I I am not the only person that use the kitchen and everyone else don't think the way that I do so sometimes there's little splatter all on here but I don't want to wipe, keep wiping this and having to wipe the paint and every few months having to um, paint it back. So I have a solution for this. And um, yeah, I have a solution for this. The next thing I want to do is... Okay. Yeah, I, I, I purchased this here oh, many moons ago. And I'm trying not to keep like too much on top here, you know, but for the coffee maker and like maybe my oils or so. And this is a paper towel holder. And it just happened to, you know, I usually have it like on a, if the refrigerator is closer to me, I would have had it there. But I, it sticks on the dishwasher. So that's where I keep it. And what I really want to show you is this here under the sink now under the sink house let me show you see if I can take you down okay yeah under the sink it has the garbage disposal that is this black thing you see here it also has the um I'm going to take you in tomorrow when I am doing all of my work under here. So, we have the garbage disposal on this side here. And then the pipes. With these things on the here, nothing could really fit, right? Nothing could really fit. So... I was thinking now to, I was thinking about, you know, the shelves that, the wire rack shelves, and it comes in, I think in two, that you could pull in and pull out so I could put the cleaning um, products in there. But I don't think that is going to work. Not I don't think, it would not work because of how low 
the um the disposal is so plus it has the um plus it have the battery pack and the electrical for the pipe the um faucet is a touch faucet like when i get back up i'll show you how it works so i was thinking to put a shelf from the highest point a shelf coming this way so then i could use the um vertical i could use the vertical space and i could use a bit of this the soap now i am planning to put the soap under the sink and let me show you in which way uh where have these pieces Okay, I am going to, let me see if I can find it first. Where are you stuck? this hose here from low and what I'm going to do is I purchased the hose oh lord I'm sitting on <laughs> this outfit is not meant to sit on the ground girl I purchased another one that's the dispenser for on top of the sink. So what I did was I purchased this hose that I could put it, it excuse me, put it into here and put the detergent under the sink. Wait, on this side? Let me put it over here so you can see. Put it under here and then run the hose from here today. And um that you know that component will be off of the um, sink area. So, so this one will be for the bleach and the other one will be for the soap. But what I'm going to do after I empty this bottle, the other bottle of um, dish liquid, I'm going to do my mixture of bleach and soap. And just leave it down here. Meanwhile, I'm going to be, after I attach the whole thing together so that I could just pump it from the top and leave the big bottle on the hair, I am going to add a shelf and then put a little lip on the back of it. So make sure that the things don't fall over. So that's the next project that I have coming up tomorrow. If I could stay in the house. Yes, yeah, so this is the holes, the clay holes that I purchased. And I'm thinking I should have purchased a longer one. But you know what? As soon as I open it, I'll be able to tell. Yeah, I'll be able to tell. And if it doesn't work before I attach it, I could take it back to Lowe's and get a longer one so I could cut them in half. So this is a 10 foot. It might work. Five and five. It's not a, hmm, I don't know. Anywho, so this one is already, they already have one right here of this, but I'm not going to use it. I'm going to just get another one. And that's what I'm going to be doing, putting a shelf right here because I can't put draw in, draws in here because how low these things are. And I want for the kitchen stuff to be in the kitchen and the bathroom things to be in the bathroom. So this is a project. You know what? 
you never really think about all all the storage you will need when you are purchasing a place. I mean, I thought I'm gonna need some storage, but I think this kitchen is for a normal person, and I'm not normal. Yes, I said I'm not normal. Because I have a million and one thing, plus I have gadgets. I'm a gadget type of person. So, there is a lot of things that I want to um, store or keep up here, and I don't think that I could. I think the kitchen downstairs would be a better kitchen, but I mean, it's just an entertainment kitchen. Like, who's going down there to cook? And then, yeah, I could cook, but nah, I ain't doing all of that, okay? If I ain't happy in this house, it none of them going to be, okay? Oh. I just had a breakdown. Anywho, um, I told you that I'm not keeping the kitchen like this, right? I'm going to give you a tour of it, but I'm not keeping this kitchen like this. I am tearing this whole kitchen down. The kitchen and the bathroom, the bathroom in my room, that model bathroom, I'm tearing it down where the bathroom is. And I'm going to show you, I'm going to take you in there, maybe after I finish here. Maybe If I finish it early tomorrow, then I'll take you over there. I'm not starting, I usually would start a million and one project and then have to be juggling like this. So no, I'm going to do this first. So, the bathroom, the master bathroom, I mean, I have a video, you can see the video from before. But that bathroom is getting toned down. And... I am, um, where the bathroom is, I am going to make like my dressing room slash beauty room slash my closet. And I'm going to give my husband a shelf. <laughs> and um, I am tearing all of that down. But I kind of like lied to my husband. I hope he don't watch my video. He better not watch my video. Anyway, I lied to my husband, right? And I told him that I will wait for a year before I go tearing stuff down. Even though I know this is temporary because I want to knock all of this down and um, the countertop, this is going downstairs. The countertop and the sink. And all of this is going to be just different. I know. I shouldn't talk loud. He's going to hear me and stop panicking. He panicked when I start, start talking about changing stuff. I'd be like, oh, he'd be like, no. So, this is what I am thinking about doing. So, yeah, this is how this look. And this one is not, it doesn't shape like that. It's the original. Oh, Lord. I'm going to leave that alone. Okay, so let me show you this sink right here. So, this is how this sucker here works. Oh, look at all my bling and rising. You see, you see that girl? I don't like, you wouldn't find me with a bling tray. You would find me with a, you know, bling, a bling, a bling. But you will find me with a bling dress. Yeah, bling dress. Yeah. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Look at this, look at this, look at this. <laughs> so... Um, this is how this work. See the water is coming out of it. And then you tap it and it turns off. Let's do it again. Water, no water. Water, no water. Water, no water. Are you going to help me pay my water bill? You keep having me show you this. Are you, Mildred. Are you going to help me pay my water bill? You telling me to show you how this works? <laughs> Love you, Mildred. I hope Raymond is okay. Tell him I hope he feels better. You said he had a doctor's appointment today. See, I have a little rooster out. And he's in copper. I was thinking about painting him black. Is that, that's, yeah, that's a rooster. Yeah, that's a rooster. I think I have the hen um, out there. 
I was thinking about painting it black and just leaving this here on white. What you think? The first person that tells me what I should paint this in the comment, then I listen to you. The first person that say, girl, you should paint this white or you should paint it black. Or girl, leave the darn thing alone. Did it ask you to disturb it? cock a doodle doo. Anywho, yeah, that's it for now. So that's all I have for you. Um, y'all look up here. You see the beauties? That's my copper. So this is it for now. And thank you for joining me. And we're gonna do this here again. And before I leave, do you want like a dance? <laughs> Hold on. I think my kids gonna fire me. <laughs> so I don't know if that was a dance, but you know it was something. It was something. So thank you so much for joining me. Love having you guys. Love the comment. Please like, subscribe, share. Hit the notification that when I upload videos, you'll be the first to notify. I just thought, you know, let me just show them what I, what they could look forward to. Because it don't look like I'm getting anything done. Like I want to paint the deck. I also want to knock the deck down. But I, I'm going to slow my roll. I, I'm not going to... I know I say I lied to my husband. Did I tell you why I lied to him? Because I told him in a year's time we're going to do the work on the house. But I'm going to listen to him. Maybe so the kind that I could convince him. <laughs> I mean, he don't need no convincing. No, all I say is, babe, let's look for a contractor. But I'm going to try to be a person of my word and not... Because I know he'll panic. Because he's like, oh, the house is perfect the way it is. I know he's saying that in his head because I'm always doing something like that um, satellite dish. <laughs> so, I'm going to go drink my coconut water because it's good. Oh, there's an island song I say. Coconut water is good for your daughter. So, I'm going to drink my coconut water because I'm somebody's daughter. Okay. So, this is it for now and... Uh, You'll see me in the next video. Okay, I'm going to stop talking. Please like, subscribe, share, hit the notification that when I upload videos, you will be the first to be notified. Love you guys. Who, actually, I thought about something. I don't think I'm going to paint my rooster black. Guess who got a black rooster in their kitchen? And I see it all the time. You know the person that I stalk on YouTube? I ain't going to call no name. You know that person. I'm going to tell you who that person is, right? They say like, um, the next time you in town. And then I went in town. And then they were nowhere to be found. They got a rooster. A black rooster in the kitchen. And you know what? I don't think I'm going to paint my rooster. I don't think I'm going to paint my rooster black. Because they don't be home. So maybe the rooster that keep them outside. But... I ain't going to call no name, but um, their first name and their title is a J, and the last one is a J, and then the ending is, you know, it's an H with a house. I ain't going to call no name because, you know what, I'm not the one to gossip. Bye, Wani, <laughs> Wani's house. Bye-bye. Take care.